guys got bad breath, get one of these or brushes. Clean your breath up. Hello, my name is Joel. This is my wife, Anna. She's hot. This is my firstborn, Caleb. He's silly. And my sweet baby girl, Ella. We're the Catalans, and together, we believe that dead is dumb, cash is king, and from reading this guy's books, we're determined to one day scream, WE'RE DEBT FREE! Follow our debt free journey as we live like no one else, so later we can live like no one else. <laughs> so we're, we're going to VidCon and we're saying bye and uh, we're hoping the kids don't cry too much so let's go next stop VidCon how are you feeling about your kids leaving your kids right now I'm okay right now I definitely feel like the heart tug but um, I know that I left him a note so she's gonna read that to him later and yeah yeah I just love him huh and I am so glad I got to see him we just shut the radio off we just set the news off and we were jokingly said like dude it's just junk it's like death and evilness and terrifying disaster things that are happening and national debt worries and bleh. it's just almost toxic there it is that's where we're going. We actually have been to this hotel before. Yeah. Tell them what it was for. You tell them. Okay. The day we got married, we spent a night there at that place. That was our wedding night. That was our wedding night there. We got dropped off by our really driver, driver and we car. walked in and everybody applauded us. Oh, it was remember so that? odd. They were like, oh, salud, salud. Yeah, everybody applauded us. Do you remember how comfortable the bed was? Oh, it was heavenly. Like, it was a heavenly it, stuff. It was, it was amazing. So we're here, and we just parked in the garage that says all day parking is $23. 24. $24, so I'm gonna go figure that right away because we ain't about to do that. Okay, so. Not a good start. Not a good start. So the parking fiasco was ridiculous. But the cool thing is, you know, you just got to talk to people. The manager here is taking care of our parking tomorrow, valet parking tomorrow, so at least there's some, at least there's a little of that, so that's exciting. So the fiasco continues after the car bit. We come in here and where our registration is, they don't have our passes. And everything started inside already in the main stage, so just one of those days, huh? And it's okay, but that's what you get for free. <laughs> Today is a gift. We won these tickets, so we're the super gift, excited. We, we got to take it. We got to roll with the punches, you know. Okay, so there he is. He had his own problems too. So now we have problems. So he's got serious problems. I got some serious problems. Like organizing all these videos like moving videos, for example. My personal. So this is fun. Yes, look at all these cool people. Mr. Guitar Man, he's over there hanging out. I'm gonna make a music video. Anna's setting up to do her video, her rap, her YouTube rap video here. She says it's awkward, but no, it's fun. There you go, see? See? Everybody does it, so. I did it and it was awkward, but. Alright, go for it. We just had lunch with our friend Tim. Tim's here. Say hi, Tim, to hi, the Tim. people. He said hi, Tim. He's very obedient, you see? His wife, Nana, is very uh, lucky. A very obedient man. He does what, what he tells. It was a great time just hanging out with Tim and catching up. And it was cool for us because we got to share our stories. Um, you know, just our stories. Uh, you know, we're on our debt-free journey. And Tim and Dana and his family are debt free. Was very encouraging sharing his story. It's so nice to see when you hear somebody who has accomplished something that you're, you know, a similar goal. It just, it just reinvigorates you. It just gives you hope, and it just, it's, it's tangible. I can touch him. He's like a debt free guy. This guy's debt free. You guys, it's amazing. So I totally embarrassed my wife. <laughs> so it's just so cool for us to, to see and to hear the story. So thanks for hanging out. Yeah. Yeah, all the, all the way, man. He flew for a four-hour delay yeah. to come out here to see us. No. <laughs> the cousin's here. I right, give him your channel so I don't screw it up. All right, add him up now. You could just search for that on Google anywhere. 
the now is actually zero for now, but I have like a future channel that has the whole. Okay, so we're gonna we'll, we'll put them in the link. So. Everyone is just kind of like mingling and doing their thing. It's so cool to see everybody with cameras and videos. You don't feel like left out. Okay, we gotta go find Sarah. Let's see if she's here. This corral, but I don't see Sarah, so we're gonna come back another time. times at VidCon. The only place where you can uh, dance and not look like a fool. Well, I guess look like a fool doesn't matter, but no one's going to judge you, right? <laughs> no, fun times. Good, good stuff. Hey, you guys got bad breath? Get one of these aura brushes. Clean your breath up. Check these guys out. Okay. So I have student loans out from the government, and uh, I keep changing my major, so I'm going to be in school forever. And then come out with like <laughs> heaps of debt and like a communications degree. Does that like, scare you at all, or? Yeah, it, yeah, it's scary right. because you know, depending on like the kind of degree you're getting and like the, the amount of like the you know the level of your school, like if you've got a really good school, you know, and what you want to do with your degree, you may not come out making that much money, and they don't really care. Do you believe that maybe you've um, been kind of just told, like, well, it's it's school and everybody has student loans and there's no way that you could do it debt free? Is that pretty? Is, is that a fair assessment to say? That is a fair assessment, especially if uh, your parents don't have the ability mm, to help you very pay. True, very true. Never get a credit card. Good. There you Good. go. Good. There you go. My family has lived their entire life in debt. My mom declared bankruptcy. We've had debt over our head for like my entire life. So my all the way through my life, I have been like, do ne never get into debt. Never ever get a credit card. That, you know, I've always had this drilled in my head. I don't have the personal debt right now because I did my first two years of school all on scholarship and That's uh, awesome. grants and stuff. But now that I'm going into my check two, two additional years, two more years, I'm noticing that more and more it feels like, ah, oh, you're gonna have to take out a student loan. You're going to have to. You're just gonna have to. That's really frustrating to me. Yeah. <laughs> Do you no. feel like you have a plan going uh, right forward? Now, I I just got a new job, and I've been ever since I got my first paycheck, I've been saving 20% of my income. It's kind of weird, but like I I I kind of prayed about it, and I like I don't care who's religious or not, but like. I basically got the impression that if I save up five thousand dollars, that I can do whatever the hell I want, and whatever spiritual guidance you believe in is going to help me get there. And that was kind of like a like a I never had a voice in your ear experience, but that was it Great. for me. And I was like, okay, fine, I'll save five thousand dollars. So I'm on my way to doing that right now, and That's then amazing. we'll see where we go from there. Well, I I just want to encourage you and just commend you because that. That's very uh, special in the midst of uh, the negative that you oh, have. Yeah. And that's very hard because... That's uh, really unique. It's very unique. It's but just hard because my mom has so much debt still. And it's like, she's always like, oh, I gotta get out of debt. I gotta, she's like $50,000 in debt. Well, this is your opportunity. Yeah, to and it's like, oh, oh, yeah. Gotta not do that. I'm a ranger danger without the A's. Ranger <laughs> danger, all right. Without the A's. Without the A's. Without the A's. Um, Chips present. It's been... So cool. So it's been so cool hanging out here today, meeting a lot of people. Looks like we're getting ready for another session. Um, we hang out over here so I can get some power on my phone. But it's been cool. We got to see our friends, um, our new friends, um, Justin and Cassie, um, and baby Johnny. They were here um, outside. I didn't think about having the camera introducing everybody. Uh, but we also met. Um, yeah, it was really cool. We all got, to, you know, I just happened to walk into a circle of all of them. Uh, Justin and Cassie and Lane from Lane Vids. Um, also Eric from uh, Eric uh, TV365. Also saw um, actually Trejos, Arturo Trejo, Nancy. They're there too. And um, an Easy E, yeah, Easy E, Coco Bean and Easy E. Oh, we're starting, so put it away.
tube socks. We're trying to find tube socks. Tube socks! No, no tube socks. Tube socks! Tube socks! Woo! I never had the camera out when when we get to connect with our YouTube friends. So Mike from Hey That's Mike and Holly from Hey That's Holly. Um, um, we got to finally meet them in person here. And you know we're like heading out. And then we see them and a bunch of other guys and they're like, I'm like, what are you doing with? But they were busy making a, a video collab, so we went on our way. But Mike came running after us. Like, hey, 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 there they go. Just wanted to you know say hi and like try to connect and stuff like that. So you know, it just warms our heart just to know that people just you know, right? Everybody seems to care about everybody. Yeah. It's like a weird world. <laughs> it is. It's like if if the world can only be like, like YouTubers and cute communities all the time, you know, it'd be, it'd be amazing. <laughs> Mike. Mike's over here turning the camera on us. So we're all having yeah. dinner. We're hanging out, stuffing our faces. Everyone's here, just having a good time. Hannah's hanging out. We're talking. Liz is over here. Tyler's over there looking at something. I don't know what. Looking for a picture of my cool dog. Oh, funny, I was just looking for a picture of my kids. <laughs> We're like showing off our kids, man. Trouble, my kids. Ah, oh, look at this. I love it. That is what I'm talking about. That's the best when you get them and you can take them to Santa. When people are talking about their kids, I'm like, get out the picture. Get out, trouble. get out trouble. Get out trouble. That is hilarious. So we're hanging out. We're they're eating. We're all eating over here. We're all having a good time. We got a babysitter for the rest of the night, so we're free. We're free. What are you doing? Waiting for Eric. Is that lazy bum? No, you go. Oh, maybe that Eric. <laughs> but you're cool too. Not as cool as Easy E. Easy E's pretty cool. Hey, Easy E, you're pretty cool. <laughs> The moment of truth. The most expensive parking we've ever paid. This is pretty much going down for uh, going down as a stupid tax in our book. Let's see. No. Nope. Ah, uh, $24. I'm a vlogging daddy.